Right, the next race is the Breeders' Cup turf. Uh, the third race on day three from the Breeders' Cup. Over 12 furlongs, the ground is soft at Louisville, a massive field of 19 horses and a lot of top class horses in this field. One is Cicero Craig Beckwith, future treasure, treasure Craig Beckwith, guard to the unexplained. Leon van Rensick, Horwich match he drawn wide, is a group one winner. Milwaukee Pepito, Vinnie Gerard, Red Rover, Padre Gogan, Seabird, Martin Needham, Storm Murmur, Davy Robertson, uh, Bella Brandy, Joshua Southern, Cathay Pacific, the arc winner. Close entry for Craig Allen as well. Joy Rider, Dan Hughes, of seller Darren Thompson, Petrovona Location, Davy Robertson, Dangerous Outcome, Josh. Sullen. House Hayden, one of the top three years, the Irish Derby winner, Morse Paul Rhodes, Rivera Paul Rhodes, and Swats Corner Darren Thompson. So 19 horses at Louisville. Going to be hard to come from those outside draws with such a big field. They're at the start. And away they go in the Breeders' Cup turf. And quickly away, Horridge much in Seabird trying to overcome those wide draws. Also on the inside, Storm Murmurs away well. And Horridge much, he goes through from that wide draw up on the outside. Cicero's also rushing around horses to overcome the wide draw. And Cicero goes to the front from Horridge much on the inside of Horridge much is Morse. Then comes Red Rover, followed by Garter, that explained. Or Silla is out wide, trapped very wide. The Russia Sullen and Pear, Dangerous Outcome, and Bella Brandy. Just behind those is Seabird. We just couldn't over overcome that wide draw. Just ahead of that, we have Future Treasure. Up on the rail is Rivera with the arc winner, Cathay Pacific, alongside that one. They're followed by Swartz Corner, Joy Rider, the two greys. Behind that closed entry, the second of the Craig Allen horses, and Bill Mark Pepito, Vernie Gerald's horse at the back of the field in those green colours. They pass the stands and they, for the first time, and they're about to head on their final circuit as Cicero takes it along for Craig Beckwith. And those blue colours with the white sleeves, Morse is on the inside for Paul Rhodes, Vasilo, and those maroon colours out four wide for Darren Thompson. Up on the inside, that is Petrovona location for Davy Robertson between horses, House Aiden. Out wide is Ballard Brandy. On the inside of that, the second Craig Burke, back with horse, Future Treasure. Garta unexplained is alongside Stable Companion, Horish Machi. Then comes Storm Murmur. Within the outside, that dangerous outcome, Seabird is trapped very wide at this stage, couldn't overcome that wide draw. Red Rover on the inside of Cathay Pacific in a good position. Uh, just just beyond that is Storm Murmur. Then on the rail we have a closed entry. Swat score now the grey pushing up between horses, followed by Milwaukee Pepita and Joy Rider. They're not much different. There's only about eight lanes first to last year. Uh, Cicero takes him along with four furlongs left to travel. Seabird is moved forward strongly for um, Martin Leadham. Just behind that is Horish Machu traveling well then. Patrivona location. Gartan explains we push along, starting to struggle. Bella Brandy on the outside of that one trying to move closer. Storm Murmur. Then comes House Hayden. We pushed along already. Rivera's on the rail. Art Wiley is featured Treasure and dangerous outcome. They start to turn for home. Yeah, Cicero in front from Horish Machu is traveling really powerfully in third. Then comes Seabird up on the inside. We push along for drone location. Rowing for strongly is Rivera for Paul Rhodes. House Hayden is trying to get going for Dan Hughes. They've got less than two furlongs left to go. And now Seabird comes to the front from Martin Needham from Rivera on the outside. Up on the inside, Petrovona location is bumped to Horish Machi. It's Petrovona location, but Horish Machi now comes to the front. And Horish Machi picks it up. Finishing strongly close entry for Craig Allen, but Horish Horish Machi has got first run and the man starts to draw clear and Horish Machi relish to the conditions yeah it's going away strongly to win comfortably Horish Machi wins it from close entry in second good run by Bella Brandy probably in third also good run by Seabird for Martin Needham but Horish Machi relish the conditions got over from that wide draw and wins from closed entry came from the back of the field Rivera was back in third Bella Brandy fourth for Joshua Sutherland and I think Seabird might have got fifth from per Petrovona location back in sixth how Aiden, I think, was just behind that. And I was Joy Ryder, actually. He says, Horish Machi wins. Close entry second for Craig Allen. Rivera third, Paul Rose. Bella Brandy fourth. And Seabird from Martin Needham. Great run. Finishes back in fifth. And picks up some prize money.